So I've been on YouTube just for over a year now and it turns out that my worst video has the most likes and uh, views. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to redo it and I'm going to put some more scientific evidence to support my claims and also some samples between acrylic, metal and felt and cork mats along with no mat. So let's get into it. First topic of the video is going to be the weight of the platters. So depending on the weight of the platter you use can have adverse effects on the playback sound. Heavier platter will result in a more well maintained playback speed. This is due to rotational mass. The inertia of the platter rotating results in the platter taking longer to react to speed changed. The disadvantage to this however is that the turntable will take longer to originally get up to speed and could place excessive strain on the bearings due to added weight. However, many companies take this into consideration when designing the rotating components by using better quality bearings with tighter specs. Now, to discuss the weight of the platters. The metal stock platter weighed 1.5 kilos, while the acrylic platter weighs only 1 kilo. This results in a 40% difference between the two platters, even though the acrylic platter is about 3mm thicker overall. Now, people claim that the use of acrylic, which is hard plastic, helps in minimizing vibrations by trapping and dissipating vibrational energy and that it avoids producing unwanted feedback into our produced sound resulting in both clarity and detail. These vibrations can be caused by various sources such as vibrations from your speakers, people walking past your turntable and even air vibrations. This can be avoided also on a metal platter however by the use of a cork rubber felt or a leather type mat. Now acrylic platters have the advantage of not needing a slip mat However, I recommend a record puck slash weight as the main surface between the vinyl and the platter is quite slippery and any warped albums may struggle to play without spinning. So what I'll do now is play a few snippets from songs recorded using both acrylic no mat, acrylic with the cork mat, metal platter with the cork mat, and then metal using a felt mat. Um, the two songs I'll be playing is the Arctic Monkeys, Why Do You In The Call Me When You're High, and the Beatles, Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds, just to get an example of the bass and then the treble in both songs. The mirror's image it tells me it's home time, but I'm not finished, cause you're not by my side, and as I arrived, I thought I I saw you leaving, carrying your shoes Decided that once again I was just dreaming Of bumping into you Now it's three in the morning And I'm trying to change your mind Left you multiple missed calls And to my message you replied Why'd you only call me when you're high? High Why'd you only call me when you're high? There you have it, different audio examples of both platters with the different types of mats. I can't hear a difference. Uh, see if you can. If you can, leave me a comment below. Cheers, guys.